Good morning and welcome to Andrea Saves. It is the last day of September. It is trying to be fall here. It is a wonderfully foggy day out, which is really exciting. And today I am going to do the challenges in this large binder. I do not have a ton of money this week. This end of the month is not the greatest for me to try to um, figure out as I have the most bills that come at the beginning of the month or at the end very end and the beginning of the month so we're going to stuff this with a little bit and then we will move on for what we will be doing later so my first one today is going to be the road to 100 subscribers this um, challenge was made by D versus debt I today officially have 65 subscribers. I thank each and every one of you for being here and for taking the time to subscribe to my channel. So that adds $2 to this fund. This money will be to do some sort of giveaway when I hit 100 subscribers. So I am going to do two for this one. And we have 50, 61, 62, 63, 64, and 65. It's adding up quickly, and it's very exciting. I imagine at the rate we're going a couple a week, it should hopefully be close to the 100 by maybe the end of the year. That would be very exciting. All right. And this is the Starbucks Challenge. Starbucks are redone, reprinted due to some sort of error or d the other bills being destroyed. And I actually did find one this week. This is very exciting. So I am going to add it to here. I don't usually have a lot of large bills, so this will probably all end up being $1 bills, but it's going to take quite a while. So I will add that to my two. The one two I have before are consecutive numbers, which is very exciting. So we will stick this in here and keep this one going. Alrighty. So the third challenge is the no spend September challenge. Uh, we left off with Friday of last week, so we will go through till this week. And so I... I was doing pretty good until the end of this week. So one, two, three, four, and five days where I spent money that was not necessary money. By necessary money, I am not counting only groceries or medical bills or gas to get to and from work because those are necessities in our life right now. And so anything above and beyond that does get counted. So for five days, we will add five dollars to this um, this will go to paying some sort of debt or something I may save it for the end of next month as well so 10 15 16 17 18 19 so I have not done very good at my no spends but it adds up it will be fine so I will finish this um, the end of this week for Friday for today uh, next week and see how that works out because I won't know for sure until the end of the day whether I have chosen to spend money or not. All right and then this um, these challenges are by hands and bands and she has already put out the October no spend challenge. I'm going to do this one with the spooky um, patterns on it but she also had a fall version as well. They're both beautiful. I love them. So I am going to do the spooky version with the kind of Halloween-y um, designs. And I'm still debating on whether I'm going to continue with $1 per day or if I'm going to try to move it up maybe to $2. We'll see. Um, I have a day or two to figure it out. <laughs> All right. And this is the Cirque du Larry. This is also by Hands and Bands. It's a very cute little challenge and since we do not have a ton this week we are going to do the three dollars today 
and he is riding on the ferris wheel i hate the ferris wheel <laughs> Uh, as I said last week, I love roller coasters, but I do not enjoy the Ferris wheel. They scare me. <laughs> I don't like being stuck at the top of any. Ooh, that's the wrong one. One, two, and three. I do not like getting stuck at the top of the Ferris wheel. So that is where my nervousness comes in. So we have 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So $36 in this one so far. It's pretty exciting. That does not seem like the right amount of money. 12, 21. Okay, yeah. Oh, I guess that's right. Whoopsie. <laughs> All right. So 36. I guess that adds up faster than I thought it did. <laughs> All right, and we are going to do the 100 cupcake doodles today. This one, I am only going to add one dollar. I hope that at some point, maybe if I do have a little extra, I can get a few more of these done a little faster. But you know what? A dollar at a time adds up eventually, so we'll be doing fine. I dropped my marker there and we're gonna make a blue cherry today because that is what I have out I only have three markers out all right so we have one and we are going to add to the rest of these so we have one two three four and five And this is by DebtFreeCharts.com. Um, I think it must have been a free gift at some point, uh, but I am not sure if it is still or not. But it is cute, and you know you can add, you can do each doodle for being however much you want it to be. As I have some other major goals in my small challenge book, um, um, these ones are a little less in money, so that I can try to do both of them right now. All right, and this one is going to be a new one. This one is by Shalice over at Mommy Trader. She had put out this $100 challenge. I believe it was for a freebie um, a few weeks back. And it is set up so that you save $100 in a month's time to um, add extra to your portfolio. I am going to do not by it the days, but I'm going to do each time as five dollars so that when I get done, it will be able to be split between my husband and I. Um, we do right now invest twenty five dollars a week in the stock market and kind of I know it's not a lot, but for right now, that's what we can do. Um, and it does also add up. It's not doing super hot right now, but. So I am just going to color in one of these little plants each time I put $5 in. Um, I have figured out that when I get done, it will give me a total of $210. And then my husband and I can split it for $105 extra on top of our normal um, investments. So that will be kind of fun. So I am going to start this one off with $5. That is very cool. All right. And that is what I have for today. This is my large binder with my larger savings challenges. And by larger, I just mean that the pages are bigger. Um, all of the other ones that I have are in my A6 binder. So... Um, I shall see you hopefully on Sunday if you are still watching. Thank you so much. Please go ahead and leave me a comment if you like it. And I look forward to seeing you soon.